Hello YouTube, it's your boy D giving you this week's season finale of Love and Hip Hop Atlanta Reunion Part 2. If you're not subscribed to my channel guys, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to my channel, hit the bell to the right to see more, more of my videos. Make sure you press the bell already in. Comment on my comment on my videos. I really appreciate you guys' comments, whether good or bad. Like my videos and of course share my videos, all that good stuff. Alright, I got that out of the way, y'all. Man, this Love and Hip Hop reunion was a, was a drag. It was boring. It was nothing really exciting. I was just like, I was literally, guys, I was on my phone, just being on my phone, playing on my phone. I think I had something to eat. I was just like, this is like, I realized something. When I was watching, you know, when I used to watch the old season of Love and Hip Hop Atlanta, Jocelyn was like the star with Stevie. And then, cause Jock was just rounded out and, and killed it. It just seems like this season is just kind of just dry. The storylines was kind of like, I didn't really care. I just was like, whatever. I feel like some people shouldn't even be on the show. Like, Killy shouldn't be on the show. You know, like, Sierra. I was like, why? Bachi was on the show. Like, why are you even there? It just was like, I feel like it is. They just threw people there just to be throwing people on the show, and I was like, "Why are you even there? It just made no sense." I honestly didn't care. I feel like the same thing with Love and Hip Hop in Miami. But even that, I give it. It just felt like it was just, just it was just not there. I was dragged. But anyway, no talking about y'all. Let's get into it. Basically, the start of Tommy and Spice. Tommy versus Spice. Tommy basically says to Spice that, "Hey." You're not really a big, you know, in you know, you know, your music sucks. Your video sucks, and I'm like, yeah, she be okay. Her video sucks, but yeah, you want to work for her, Tommy? Okay, because Spice called it out on her drinking, and, you know, and, and Tommy's like, you know, I'm not, I am not drunk. I have this ankle braces on because I just want to have an ankle braces on to show you that I'm not drunk. I'm like, sis, girl, really? So you just gonna wear an ankle? Ankle bracelet, right? Like I'm not gonna purchase an ankle bracelet just because to show people my job. You tried it, boo. You tried it. I mean, cause Spice called out. She was unprofessional. She was late. Cause you remember last season, she was, and this season she was late because of a pig, a pig. And Spice is like, a pig, you know, a pig. <laughs> cause you late, cause you pig was pig was sick. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay, Tommy. Basically, Tommy, you know, nobody really calls Tommy on anything. Everybody kind of babies Tommy and kind of let Tommy do what she going to do. And you kind of see it on the show. Like, everybody was like, oh, okay, Tommy's Tommy. It's okay. It's kind of like the kids, you know, like you're saying, do second like kid that no one corrects the kid and let the kid do whatever they want until somebody says otherwise. And that's like, Spice is like person is going to say no. I don't care who you are. I'm not going to baby you. I'm not going to kiss your, you know what, A. I'm gonna tell you the truth, regardless how you feel about me. I'm okay. I ain't scared of you, and she she wasn't scared of Tommy. And you could tell that she ready to throw down, cause she got them ladies, girl. I look at the ladies. I think she might choke somebody with them legs, boo. She got even from Jamaica, so I know she she tough as nails, and <laughs> she about to fight too. I mean, she you know. I mean, Tom disrespected Spice the whole time, saying her music suck. And this and that, her video sucks. But yeah, she, Spice was telling like in Jamaica, she was getting like 70 views. So she obviously she doing something like that. She get to get like 7 million views. She knows she good. I mean, obviously the states a little bit different because it's like 50, 50 states. So it's gonna take some time for her to transition. Cause Tommy gets out with my like, why are you gonna come out loving hip hop Atlanta for then? You big over there. But you know, because Spice says I want to make it big here. Take my music transfer over here, and I'm like. But Tommy says, ain't nobody who heard of you. The only time people heard of you, that you're drunk, you get into fights, and you act crazy. You know what I'm saying? You ain't really got no good track record, boo. You know? You're not for, you got, you got memorable moments, but something that I don't even want to brag about. I mean, the last time you were scrapped, you looking all crazy, going after the truck, you looking all... Sis, you, 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 Tom, you ain't good. You wild out. You mean, girl, you need help. Even my looking at like look at Tom like embarrassed. You know what I'm saying? So they eventually broke up the whole thing. Right? And then we had um 
Then we have BK versus. I'll see you. What's this? Sierra. Yeah, Sierra. Sierra is basically. Oh, and Shooter, yeah. Shooter feels like, you know, that uh, Sierra should have been with him more because it's because his son died, which was a sad moment. But Sierra said, look, I was trying to reach out to him, but every time I reached out to him, he, you know, he blocked me away. So I'm like, yeah, so if she's trying to reach out to you, you really can't you the ones pushing away, so it's not, it's not really her fault. Like, you, you know, you blocking on social media, what she want, and what you want her to do, come after you, chase you down? No, bro. No. And then clearly steps in talking about, you, you, they'll still, you're still married, we messing around with, uh, with BK. And I'm like, sis, shut up. You know, Shooter was shooting shots, getting somebody pregnant, cheating on her during the marriage. But you ain't say nothing about him, him, right? And you know, Sierra kind of calmed down because she don't want. You know what I'm saying, and Kelly is just. I'm sorry, yo. Why Kelly look like she old? In this video, she look like she's. Where did her makeup? Where did the outfit? She look old in that video. Sometimes she's young, but she look old. Look like she's in the fifties, yo. Yo, she look. Like, she look. She look like a grandmother for real. No shade. No shade for real. She look like. A, Grandmother, just look at that outfit. Don't tell me she don't look like she look like she look like a grandmother for real. You know what I'm saying? She look like she old though. Wow, damn. But I digress. I digress. Anyway, moving on. Ooh. Anyway, um, and Sierra was basically telling you know, you know, you know, basic beans. You kill the tea, give her the tea, right? And then you see, and then. Sierra it was asked a question about you know BK cheating on her, allegedly cheating on her, and you know BK was like, oh, I don't know if cheating on her, you know what I'm talking about. I never cheated with Joy. I never cheated with this person, this time, this time in person, and you know. But there was there was receipts, the you know there were there were proof that he was missing out. Joy talking about, I want you know I want. George riding on him and see it looks so the thing and see it just was kind of like plays off saying like well you know I can't we get mad at him because he's you know we ain't the force I'm like I was like see you really he's he's BK is doing the same thing she was doing and you just allow he allowed his man to stay with him because I think he's so insecure that you need a man like you sis you need to be by yourself you need to get your life together get you be by yourself you know what I'm saying? Spend time with your family, kids, you know what I'm saying? And then, and then BK's talking about, you know, PK, PK, there's a question about BK saying, you know, do you see, a, do you want to marry, you know, Sierra? Talking about, oh, I don't, really, don't want to marry her, I want to just be friends, da 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 da. But like, bro, like, two episodes, two episodes, like, you know, and this is you or on her knees talking about, I want to marry her. This is now, I said, get out of here, bro. You know what I'm saying? And, and, you know, you know, Carly Red don't even like him. So, I was like, I guess, I don't know if they're still together, y'all. So, I ain't going to say, I heard they're still together. I don't know if they're still together or not. So, who knows? Who knows? Who really, I don't really don't care anymore. And then, you had a couple of scenes with um, Mama D on the show. You know, Mama D there. I'm like, Mama D... I don't know why Mama D is there because she really didn't serve no purpose just to be comic relief. I mean, she was just, she plays the role of comic, do like Mama D does, talking about she, you know, she painted the room and scraps house and looking like, I don't even really care anymore. You know what I'm saying? She's just there to be there. You know, and of course, you know, you have. Bashi there. I don't know why Bashi is there because Bashi didn't serve no purpose. Like Bruce Defenders didn't serve no purpose. A lot of scenes, it really didn't serve no purpose. It just was like, Mona, you gotta do better, girl. You, you ain't, it's like, what you were there for? I mean, you know. Oh, oh yeah, I'm sorry. I know I missed something. Tokyo. Tokyo was funny. Tokyo was, I ain't gonna lie, Tokyo was the high level of this show. Yeah, Tokyo was counting, um, Kili talking about, because Kili's talking about, you know, I signed artists, and Tokyo was like, you know, who, he never signed anybody, A-O-R. 
I was like, Toki, you ain't right. You ain't right, but you funny, though, girl. You ain't right. Apparently, Tokyo is going to, you know, spice me up. Because Spice says she, you know, when somebody call her fat. I guess in Jamaica, when somebody call you fat, it's kind of like a demon. It's not body shaming. So she didn't think what she was doing is body shaming. And, and Tokyo kind of understood it's the same way somebody call you a B. They ain't really, she didn't think about his body shaming either because, you know, disrespect is how you say it. Like, hey, B, what's up, B? Or you'd be like, that B over there. You know what I'm saying? So it's, it's, how, you, it's how you say it, or the tone of it. But anyway, they, they kind of like worked it out, which I'm glad. I'm glad they worked it out. And I'm guessing they're going to do a video because I took once to do a video with Spice. So, you know, no, I'm cool with it. I'm down with it. That's what's up. That's what's up. <laughs> and, uh, you know, Tokyo's, I think Tokyo would be good for the show. I feel like Tokyo could be the show because she got, she's young, she's energetic, and she got her own personality, and she's, she's her own, you know, own person. So I think she could definitely, if there's more money, you need to keep Tokyo, keep Jock, maybe keep, keep Sierra, and, shoot, that's about it. Carly, keep Carly, there, there you go, keep Carly. Keep calling because you know you, you gotta go mind you keep calling the show. But after yeah, so really that was it with the Love and Hip Hop Miami reunion. It was uh it wasn't nothing really exciting. I feel like they could have not even have part two because part two was just a waste of my time. Could have kept part one, kept the movie, you'd be alright. I'm gonna keep this reunion a C minus. The whole se whole season of C minus it ain't really worth nothing. You know what I'm saying? They need to do better. They got to do better. And they need to do better anyway. But only get it together, go. Get it together. Anyway, this is your boy D. I am out. Have a good night, y'all. Bye.